Hey everyone, welcome back. Dubai is set to open a 2,000-seater opera house, while Dubai Metro stops are set to become nothing less than art galleries. Dubai has hopes to become the world's cleanest city. Hotel rooms across the Emirate are set to double in the next few years. And watch this video that's taken the city by storm, quite literally. You're with me, Jessica, on The Roundabout. Dubai is famous for its modern architecture and technology, but what does it do for the people who prefer something more classic? Well, a 2,000 seat opera house is set to be built in downtown Dubai in the new upcoming opera district. And here's the interesting thing about it. It's allegedly set to be designed in the shape of a traditional dough. The state-of-the-art opera house is set to utilize the best of technology to showcase the vibrant arts, culture and event scene of Dubai. And, as usual here in the city, this won't just be any regular opera district with plans to feature luxury hotels, elegant residential apartments, waterfront promenades and a retail plaza, of course, as well as a sky garden and a rooftop restaurant. Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid has launched a plan to turn Dubai Metro stops into art galleries with the Metro Museums launched to coincide with the launch of Art Dubai 2015. Now, according to Sheikh Mohammed, the new Metro Museums will display creativity and beauty, which is an essential part of the culture and identity of Dubai, as well as part of our daily lives here. Not only will it aim to enhance the quality of life and smooth and safe transport, but it plans to transform Metro stations into destinations of culture, creativity and aesthetics. Definitely something to look forward to. Dubai has a vision of becoming the cleanest city in the world by 2020 and is doing all it can to help achieve this. The Waste Management Department of the Dubai Municipality has begun a massive door-to-door -door awareness campaign on waste management, inviting innovative ideas from the public to help reach its goal. Dubai is already allegedly the cleanest city in the region, but still plans to make Dubai the world's number one in the near future in terms of awareness on public cleanliness and effective waste management. We all know Dubai's hotels are mostly fully booked over the weekends and sometimes aren't much better during the week. And this is before the expected 20 plus million guests that are expected to come to Dubai in the Expo 2020 year. Now with this in mind, Dubai is planning to nearly double its amount of hotel rooms by then. Now obviously Dubai won't become a ghost city after the 2020 year, but it's certain that the now 85,000 and soon to be about 160,000 hotel rooms will certainly help ease traffic. If you will, the hotel rooms, which are always a good thing for the sheer increase in tourism numbers Dubai has been seeing over the last few years. The My Dubai campaign is becoming more popular than ever on social media app Instagram, headed by none other than the Crown Prince of Dubai himself. Sheikh Hamdan bin Rashid recently posted an incredible aerial video of Dubai on his Instagram account, Fazar, and received more than 53,000 likes within six hours. Another video showing a different perspective of Dubai is one of epic proportions, which shows a recent sandstorm that we experienced in the Emirates seemingly about to engulf nothing less than the world's tallest building. This campaign is really taking the social media world by storm, and even if you haven't got a private jet to show a bird's eye view of the city, Everyone is encouraged to take part in the campaign and share the fabric which makes up the city and the cultural flavour that is Dubai. That's all that we have for you on this episode of The Roundabout. Don't forget to like us, subscribe, share this video and follow us on Twitter at The Roundabout 2. Here's your weather for the week. Have a lovely weekend.